Hi, Pastor Nathan Decker with your hashtag Better Together Devotion for today. Yesterday I talked about beginning with the understanding of family dynamics, and I started with the idea of God as Father. God could also function as a mother. In fact, one of the interesting coincidences, if you go back through church history, it, not only is it statistically important that fathers would come to church and lead their families to church, but it's extremely important that mothers Mothers who exemplify God's nurturing, God's, God's grace, oftentimes God's more understanding aspects than the father. Uh, it, you, when the mothers are, are a part of the faith, they often plant seeds of leadership and of love that blossom into wonderful, unique human beings. So, for example, if you go back through church history and you look at some of the big names uh, for us as United Methodists, that's John Wesley and Martin Luther or, or St. Augustine, well, even, let's be honest, Jesus. Who is it that made the biggest impact, who, who gets named and gets the most mentions in their stories as the life? Guess what? It's always the mom. It's the mother. It's Mother Mary for Jesus. For Martin Luther, it's his mother. For St. Augustine, it was his mother. For, for, for John Wesley, it was Susanna Wesley, his mother. Yeah, moms have a per tremendous impact on the future faith of their children. I've often joked with my own wife that the umbilical cord may have been cut, but it's still there's still a connection there between her and our children that, that is deep. And it, and it makes it to where she has a, a, a different understanding, a different relationship with them than I, and that's a good thing. We need to have mothers in the church. We need to have mothers who adopt not only their own children in faith walk, but also mothers who will adopt other lost orphans and children that they might know of God's nurture, that they might know of God's patient understanding, that they might know of God's just sympathy and empathy. When we as the church uh, take on the understanding of God as father and God as mother. What we're doing is not limiting, but we're expanding our understanding about who's inside the congregation and what we can be. We can be a people of faith who exemplify what it means to, to parent and mentor and love and teach and, and nurture each other. Go look for opportunities to, to find those kids in your community who need an extra lift, who need someone to uplift them, who need someone to be connected to. I remember a story from my first appointment of a lady named Lucille. Lucille would go around in her 1965 Mustang picking up loads and loads and loads of kids. In fact, there was a story about the brakes going bad on her Mustang and, and they saw her you know, slowly slowing down the car by putting her high heel shoe down on the road with the car door open just to be able to get those kids to church. It's a hilarious story, a great image, but it's also what we're supposed to be. We're supposed to be those that go and, and procreate in this world, not just through our own physical bodies, but through our faith and our love like a mother. Amen.